Hey guys, it's the Family Squad, and today, like I said in my other video, I will be sharing the stories of my interactions with boys online. And like I say in a lot of my, well, some of my videos, I don't like talking with boys online. Even if they don't even say anything gross, I am like, I don't like you already. <laughs> Especially when they're like, how old are you? I'm like, let's not get into that right now. <laughs> um, so... Um, and also, like I said in my other video, most of the guys that I've met online that are disgusting and pervs, um, I've met on the Amino app, so that's why I hate that app with all of my heart. Well, not all of my heart, because some of the people that don't have social media, I can talk to them on there. But, hey, um, so, uh, if you got, if anybody that's watching this has Amino and talks to me on there, and if you're wondering why I don't talk back, I'll tell you guys why in this video. So, um, let's get started. Um, wait, before I start, this topic involves suicide, so if you guys aren't comfortable with that topic, you might want to just skedaddle and maybe watch my other video that has me reading my dreams out loud, because if, uh, because, hey, it's a very, suicide's a very important topic and it's not supposed to be made fun of. Stop. Okay, the first ever boys that I met online that were perverse, well, I, I wouldn't really, the first time I've ever talked to one, I guess, I've seen them, but there was one on Roblox for Abby, it was so gross. I'll, um, share that at the end, um, if I remember. Um, so, the first guys that I met on, well, the first pervs that I met online were these two boys. If you're watching, yeah, I'm gonna expose you. You're lucky I don't know your names. Uh. I already forgot their names anyways, I don't even know if they remember, I don't even remember if they told me their names, so, um, there were these two, they said, uh, quote unquote, they were twins, or brothers, so, what happened was, um, on the Mino, you can message people, okay, so, one of them messaged me, okay, so his profile was, like, dark or something, it was literally called dark or something, was, I don't know, so, he was, um, he was, like, I, don't, I, I do not remember the rest of, I do not remember the beginning part of this stuff because, hey, I was like 11, 12, or 13 when this happened, and then again, I have terrible memory. So, um, he was like, a, a casual conversation, okay, no harm, no done. So I'm just like, hey, do you want to see my OC Sally? And he's like, okay, yeah, sure. So I show him. Oh, that. So many guys. I show them the, her picture. They say that she's hot and sexy i do not see it like no comprehendo um i can i hmm. i i know you guys have seen pictures of her before um i need to find it uh you call this you call that sexy and hot you call that okay here's another one here's another one you call that You call this? What? Okay, so anyways, um, and plus, she has ears and a tail. It's weird. I don't know. Um, so apparently, we got all roleplay-ish and we got weird. And I'm like, what are you doing? He's like, oh no, we're not roleplaying, sweet. I'm like, <laughs> sure. I don't remember what happened, but all I remember was, like, I'm not a sex machine. I'm like, I know. <laughs> um, but, like, uh, these guys are so weird and so uncomfortable talking about them. But, hey, I want to talk about them at the same time. So then, um, what happened uh, mainly was, like, I showed him and he's just, like, oh, my gosh. Some sexual content right here. He was, like, can I, squish, can I squish your chest? I'm, like, sure. I was stupid at the time, okay? He was my first ever online dater that I've ever met. So, um, he was like, oh he, guess what he said? He's just like squishes. I'm like, alrighty. Oh my gosh, it was so weird. I hated it yeah. so much. The chest. It was. Yeah, at least it's not his. Anyways, um, oh, I can get flashbacks from 
I hate this topic so much. Oh my gosh, there's one dude I used to talk to. Oh. Continuing on. Uh, I'm like overreacting at this. I mean, I wouldn't say overreacting because I mean, who would react like how I am if this. So. Yeah, so there's like a lot of sexual stuff happening between us. Not like literally face to face, but like role play. He's like, we're not role playing. I'm like, okay. But instead I'm like, yeah, we are. So don't even. Oh my gosh, it was so weird. I don't remember much what happened to him. So he was just like saying, hey, I'm in war and I don't think it'll last very long. I'm like, why? He's like, cause I got shot. And I'm like, can I see what you look like? He's like, oh yeah, sure. So he sends me a picture of himself and it looks like he's like crying or something like that. And I'm like, I'm sorry. I hope you survive. He's like, I probably won't. I won't be here much longer. So, he's like, uh, he's like, this is also my brother. And so he shows me a picture of his brother or twin, whatever it was. So then he's just like, he's going to be taking over my account once I'm dead. I'm like, okay. It was so weird. So then after he quote unquote died because of war, his brother's like, hey, I'm his brother, and I heard that, and I'm sorry that he died. I'm like, it's fine. I'm sorry that he died, too. It was like, then again, also, like I said before, I have terrible memory, and this was a long time ago. So he asked me the same question, just like how the other do with my OC. I'm like, yeah, sure, whatever. So I got sick of it. I'm just like, yeah, go ahead. I don't care. So we do that, and, like, things get weird again. And he's just like, um, he's like, did you, I don't remember what he asked me, but it was something about, like, love or, like, dating. And I'm like, I already like someone. He's just like, oh, huh. So, apparently, he had a crush on me, too. So, he's just like, I love, I, I, your OC is really sexy and I like her. I'm like, okay, cool, nice to know. <laughs> uh, I'm not joking, it was so comfortable. It was so uncomfortable. So, then, um, later on, he's just like, huh, I thought you really liked me. I'm like. I don't. So then, um, uh, what was going on? Uh, I forgot already. Um, he was like saying stuff like, because of you, I'm really sad now. I, I forgot what it was, but like, I'm so uncomfortable because of it. And then he was like saying, hey, this is so his friend. They both died. I'm like, how they both died? And he's just like, well, they both died of suicide because of you. I'm like, what? So, like, I'm like, why did they die of suicide? He's like, because you didn't like them and that you like someone else. Because at the time I said I was dating someone. So then they're like, oh, huh. So then they were like, oh the dude was like, yeah, they killed themselves because of you. I'm like, well, I was being stupid at the time, okay. So, oh man, I regret that. I should have said, hey, I had an online date. No comprehendo. <laughs> um, so, um, that was the two guys that I met before. Um, I only remember, like, four of them. <laughs> um, the recent one, well, I wouldn't say really recent, but, um, another one that was on Amino. Um, oh, he was the next, I think it was the next one. There was another dude, uh, I used, I used to talk to him on Discord, but I don't talk to him anymore, thankfully. Although I really want to tell him, like, hey, I don't like you. So, what happened was, um, I don't remember if this was, like, Quartz Official or Roleplay Amino. So, what happened was, um, uh, he was just like, hey, I'm like, hi. He's like, how are you? I'm like, so we had a casual conversation. He's like, how old are you? I'm like, 13. He's like, oh man, I'm 14. I, I'm like, oh. So, he was just like. Hey, when we, like, a while later, he's just, like, a, a while later, um, not that day, but, like, a little later in the future, he's just, like, um, we were, like, ro well, yeah, we were role-playing, and so it was, like, some school girl thingy, I was playing a Sally, and he's just, like, wait, so he was, like, saying, like, romantic stuff, he's, like, I can't wait to date her and stuff like that in the role-play, I'm, like, it just hit me, I'm, like, wait a second, wait a second, are you trying to, do you like me? He's like, no, maybe. I'm confused about my feelings. <laughs> Kill him. I'm like, just, do you like me or not? He's like, well, yes. I, he didn't say yes, I do. But, like, there's this one point where he was like, 
I I kissed we kissed in the role play because I it was a way for me to like I, it was an excuse for kissing you. He was like I mean uh, I'm like. So then, um, so he's just like, when are you able to online date? I'm like, never. And he's, I'm just like, my parents said I can't and I never will. He's like, I'm going to get off of him, you know, and cut myself. Bye. I'm like, wait, where are you going? So I'm like, so confused at this moment. And he was, he literally just told me, I'm going to go cut myself now. I'm not going to be on Amino anymore. Bye. I'm like, I still have the screenshot on my phone. I just don't want to go for it because... Like on my Chromebook, I can't pause stuff and then resume. So, um, we continued role play, and apparently I was Ayano, and we got really disgusting sexual stuff going on. And in the role play, it was so weird, and I absolutely hate it. Um, he was like saying later on, he's just like, "Hey, want to have kids?" He was just like, "What? When we meet, we should have kids." I'm like, "No." No, 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 no. Big steps. Big step. No, uh You ain't crossing this line because if you do, taser! Uh, I didn't say that, but, um. So then, I was like, no, but we can adopt. Because at the time, I obviously knew that I wasn't ever going to date him because, like, it, no. So he was just like, um. So then we were doing a role play again. Oh my gosh. Okay, um. We'll just skip this part section for now. He he said that he got me. Guess what? You guys can guess. I don't care. Go ahead. I don't care. Guess what he said that he got me. I'm like. Ha! So then I got like really. Oh my gosh. I still don't like this dude to this day. But so then um it was on Discord or whatever. A bit later it's just like. Who is this? Oh my gosh, is this anime artist? Because that was my uh, profile name on Amino. I'm like, yeah. She's like, oh my gosh, I miss you so much. I'm like, why'd you get kicked out of Amino? He's like, I don't know. But then just hit me. I'm like, I reported him. Maybe he does other people too. Yes, my plan worked. <laughs> um, so, um, I, I don't remember how I felt that day, but um, so we didn't do that disgusting stuff, but he was like saying things like kisses. Hugs, nuzzles. I'm like, Ooh. so. Oh my gosh. So he's just like, I'm just like, I don't like you. You still know that, right? He's like, I'm gonna go kill my. You know what? I'm just gonna go kill myself. I'm like, dude, this is not what the world's about. You're here for a purpose. Like, I get you had depression and all, but like, you don't have a reason to do that just because I don't like you. And, he, and I'm just like. Why don't you just go on, like, eHarmony or something, or, like, freaking an online dating app? He's like, because I, I only like you. And I'm like, you don't know that. Why don't you just go out in the real world, too? He's like, no, I've been heartbroken way too many times, and I don't want to be heartbroken again. Ah, well, guess what? That's life for you, honey. I'm just kidding. That's disgusting. That's life for you. That's love for you. You get heartbroken, move on. Or hold on to it. Just don't kill someone because of that. Just... That's love for you. You get heartbroken so many times. That's love for you. Are you new to it? What? You're 15 or 16? And Go if, away. And you, if you get heartbroken, then, I don't know, you can probably just visit other girls. So, I, uh, I was just, I got so many, I got, oh my gosh, I was so stressed because of him because, like, he, he kept on saying, like, whatever I said, I don't want to date him. He's like, I'm going to go kill myself now. I'm like, I didn't know what the heck to do because how was I supposed to know if he was faking or not? It was over text. You know how many times people say that they do that stuff when they really don't and they just guilt trip people? This is the reason why I don't like talking to people unless I know them face to face. Uh, my video is getting long so I'm probably going to stop this here but one more thing. Um, so it's still about this dude. Um, I forgot his name too. Uh, so what happened was... Um, so we obviously got talking still, and um, whenever I talk to him, he's just like, I love you. I'm like, yeah, I know you do. <laughs> so then, um, uh, he's just like, even though I, even though you don't love me, I still love you, even when we turn 50. I'm like, but I de make you depressed and want to kill yourself. He's like, that's what love's about. Yeah, so it's being heartbroken. 
Um, oh gosh, I still hate this dude. Like, I care for him, sure, but I don't want to be. I'm, I'm like, I'm friend. I'm fine with being friends with you. He's just like. Ever since my brother died, I've been thinking of joining him in death. I'm like, why? How did he die? He's like, because he was in the hospital and his girlfriend did something, something, something. And I'm like, oh, sorry. So, here's a little lesson for you guys. And how to spot an online dater right at that moment. Um, I'll make a part two of this some, some other time, but, um, Here's some tips for you to find an online dater. Like, here's some tips for you to know if someone's trying to online date you. One, if they say hey to you, it's all lowercase, leave. Because most of the people that I've talked to online that are boys that want to date me start with that, including this suicidal dude. Uh, two, they ask how old you are, leave. Three, they ask for a picture of you. Leave. Um, so that's the main three steps or tips, whatever. I don't care. I'm like, I get so depressed when I talk about this topic because, like, I don't know if they really die. Because if they really did, what if they haunt me? What, like, how am I supposed to know if they really did die? Huh? How am I supposed to know if they really did die? Like, what if they did and I thought that they didn't? What if they still haunt me because of this stuff? Like, I get that they're probably guilt tripping me and, like, making it sound scary and all, but, like, it still haunts me to this day from those two boys. Like, it still haunts me. Like, I'm still scared they could have died in... Positive comments, please. Can I please get some positive comments down below? I am not in a good mood now because I was talking about this. Um... <sighs> Scratch that. I'm not going to make a part two of this unless I really feel like I'm up to it. Um, if you guys want to know the rest of the story stuff, I can leave my Instagram stuff down below, but you guys have to ask for my Instagram first, because I'm not just leaving in my description, and just being like some somebody sliding into my DMs like, hey, like, just ask me in the comments below if you want my Instagram, my Twitter, Facebook, whatever I can message you on, so that way I can tell you guys some other info about the boys that I've met online, so, um, yeah, like I said, Positive comments, please. I'm now really depressed. I'm, I'm now, like, really stressed and stuff like that. And, like, please give me positive comments down below. It can be anything positive, but it has... Oh, my gosh. Please let it be positive. Um, but anyways, guys, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Stay safe on the internet, guys, please. I learned that the hard way. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Stay healthy. Stay safe. Bye.